Good morning, collective. <laughs> Guys, so first off, don't forget today at 8 p.m., we're doing the sip and paint manifestation like we did last time. Um, make sure you guys have your canvases, your paints, because we're going to go live. We're going to do this um, today. Um, also, guys, I'm so excited. I got to tell you guys what I'm creating. Um, well, what I created <laughs> the, um, yesterday. I'm going to show you guys on my live. Okay? So make sure you guys are staying tuned. I've been wanting to to do this for a while um and i was telling my boyfriend about it and yesterday we finally got the stuff and we started getting it done so i'm really excited it's not finished yet this is something i created um for my personal space hopefully it inspires you guys um to want to do the same um, yeah, let's jump into this. Ancestors of the highest white light. Archangel Michael asks that you place the seal of protection around me as I open myself to get these messages from my beautiful ancestors of the highest white light. What is the overall energy? Overcoming obstacles. A lot of you guys are overcoming obstacles at this time. Spirit said you could overcome anything. I don't know what this bird is. I think that's a cardinal. I kept seeing that bird yesterday at the park. rejuvenating rain clear the past heal the present I feel like there's a there's a transformation so a lot of you guys may have felt like you guys were being blocked by certain past experiences past people places things emotions kept coming up but that was for you to heal the present heal it now rejuvenate it heal heal those emotions those past obstacles whether it's a person a place there was something that needed to be healed within that i feel like you guys are doing it i see a lot of water which represents emotions so there was some kind of emotion tied to this but you guys overcame it you did it yeah joy and delight open your heart to joy I feel like your emotions were blocked. Your emotions were blocked is what I'm feeling here. But it was something from your past that needed to be healed. That was the obstacle. like you guys are opening up now you a lot of some of you guys need to do heart chakra if you haven't already done it i feel like you're clearing your past to heal the present moment you can do anything spirit said yeah it was a narrow path you were scared to to, to tread on this whatever this thing is whether it's a person a place a thing an emotion from your past from childhood it was something you were scared to to touch on but spirit wanted you to know that you going through this path was going to help free this blockage it was going to help bring you to your joy and delight releasing whatever this was and healing it yeah it was bringing you to your son. You needed to dive deep in there. Passion and pleasure. 
savor your life. I feel like you're dancing now. Something's been sparked within you, collective. Something has been sparked within you. Thank you, Spirit. You guys are singing, dancing, and your passion more. You don't care who sees. Your discernment right now is very strong. This is helping you open up. Waiting. needed to be hold on <coughs> oh! oh shit I hate sneezing it's like the worst thing to ever do like where did that come from like why do we have to sneeze what is the importance of it like seriously it's just a nuisance. I feel like you guys were sitting here in this waiting energy. Trying to figure out what was what was blocking you. I want to get a little bit more in this discernment. What is this discernment spirit? I feel like you guys were using your discernment. Yeah. Your emotions. You holding on to whatever this block was. It wasn't allowing you to surrender. Where you guys, I feel like you guys... Or some of you guys need to use your discernment with a Queen of Cups energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I just seen the Devil card. Somebody from your past. I feel like yeah that you walked away from I feel like you not clearing these emotions was not allowing your discernment to come through clear for you guys it wasn't allowing it kept you in a waiting energy but I feel like the moment you cleared this up you, do, you dove deep and you started releasing whatever this was because there's a lot of emotions this is what I'm getting you released it some of you guys, you block somebody from energetically connect, um, communicating with you. This person has no more access to you. This is somebody that you may have walked away from that left you in your head that was making you confused. waiting for this person 
energetically holding space for this person I'm hearing. The moment you release this person, I feel like that kept your, your, you wasn't, your, your discernment was not clear. It was blocking your decision making. That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm feeling. Yeah, you had to be strong, strength to walk the fuck away. I feel like you try to open your heart to this person. I'm not taking all of this. Now, this person's in the energy of the Five of Swords, confused. Like, yeah, this is what I'm getting right here, you see? This is you, this is you. Whatever this person was doing was like, you were holding space for them. It kept you confused and you wasn't able to listen to your discernment to walk away, but you finally did. You, you made a pathway to release this. beautiful ancestors activation something's been activated within you i feel like you re released that's what i'm getting released it you finally spoke it out you finally let it let it release you didn't want to do this i feel like you really didn't want to do this you, you was treading lightly Whatever you released, whether you spoke it out loud, you thought it in your mind. Spirit said you did it effortlessly. You released it. You seen things from a higher perspective right now. You realize, yeah, your ancestors are proud of you. Your ancestors were pushing you to release this. Release it, I'm hearing. Release it. And you did. You made the decision to fucking release it. I know what I'm feeling here. You surrendered it. You got tired of waiting. You got tired of being stuck in confused confusion. And you released it. Yeah, you vacuumed away the fear. Yeah, because this is who you are. You're an empress, an indigo. Yep, you took that leap of faith on yourself and you started closing out those cycles. Yep, you cut the cords. I can't get any more clearer than this. Let's get you guys an angel message and we're going to close this out. Somebody opened up, made room for some new to come in. Spirit guide, your ass, what did I say? I said it. I said it. Your ancestors were pushing you, right? I opened my heart to the to my guides and trust in the wisdom they share with me. They showed you something, I'm telling you, that made you make that decision. And they were pushing you. Whatever this decision was, your spirit guide showed you, they were pushing you to close this out. And you did it. Yeah, you freed yourself. Breach. <laughs> Completion, look I'm not playing with you, I know what I'm feeling Somebody really fucking Closed out a cycle here What else? Now you're able to open up for more This is beautiful Sacral chakra, number 10 Completion I feel comfortable in my own body and I'm sensitive to other people's feelings. Yeah, there was something about feelings, emotions here. You were very sensitive. You were picking up. You had to cut the cords. You had to cut the cords. Will of life. Look at the will of fortune is in your favor for releasing this. 
I am guided by the cycles of life and live in complete harmony with them. You definitely are now. Whoever I'm speaking to, whoever you are, you're coming out as this goddess, Hierophant, who sees things from a higher perspective. You're an indigo. This is what I got for you. Love and light.